uh, is there something that we can communicate to people that you know genes are really not your destiny in many cases right? it is more a, you know there's still a guide but a lot depends on what you are doing with that information so how do you communicate that yeah uh, absolutely yeah so some of the lifestyle diseases like uh, uh, diabetes cardiovascular diseases hypertension many more uh, so there are lifestyle diseases and it it has uh, it has increased in greater number uh, in the last two generations that's again mainly because of uh, the lifestyle uh, and uh, our genome is adopted for low metabolizing with the limited food available to three generation back uh, because now uh, it's reverse so genome is adopted to do low metabolizing the whole thing but uh, the intake is too much so we are unable to, our body is unable to cope up with that so in the uh, in terms of uh, evolutionary perspective of course we need to wait for maybe few generation to have new set of mutations which can effectively metabolize uh, the high fat or high sugar content uh, diet which we take but until then it's it's very important for us to take care uh, better avoid and uh, do exercise which is another major issue those who are living uh, in the cities uh, not finding time including me right uh, so few generation back and not even generation because my childhood I, as i mentioned that um, i born in the the farming family in the village so without knowing that we are doing exercise we always do some activities right so that is yeah so that is totally stopped now unless otherwise we have to spend exclusively some time to do some exercise otherwise even today in the village people they they work hard physically so uh, their lifestyle is uh, such that without knowing or without realizing that they are doing exercise they are doing as a part of their activities so that is very very important people to understand that